Hi boys and girls, it's Queen Bee from Honey Bee Toys and today I'm going to show you my eraser collection. So this is some of my eraser collections, there's a lot more, but these are my desserts. So I'm going to show you some of my favorites, which is my macaroon. So this is like a green macaroon, maybe pistachio, and like a lemon macaroon and it's yellow. And these are also some sort of cookie, I'm not quite sure, but what I really love about these all these erasers is that they come apart. And you can interchange them however you like them. So I'm going to pull all these apart and show you. So even these pink ones and whatever, whenever it's a different color, it just comes apart. So you notice that these two were like different colors and they come apart. So if I wanted to change my green macaroon to have a white filling, I can just push that in and then have a yummy macaroon with a white filling. And then if I wanted to have a green filling for my little cake, I would just, well, let's do the yellow filling. I would just put this yellow one in and then put the bottom on like that. So these are super cute, and then I can take my green macaroon, my yellow macaroon, and put the green filling in. Like that. Or you can even be super silly and then take your filling and then do a, just like a rainbow colored macaroon. So isn't that silly? You can really do whatever you want with these. Swap them around however you please. You can even take this one and swap it. If I wanted to have chocolate instead. I would pull this chocolate one out and then pop it in. So I love these erasers because you can just play around with them however you want. So let's look at the rest of my desserts. So I have these two pieces of cake and again you can change out if you have this chocolate cake with a strawberry on top. You can pull out the strawberry and then pull out these mandarin oranges over here and then swap it. So now I have a chocolate cake with peaches or mandarin oranges on top. I'm not quite sure what that is and this key lime cake with a strawberry on top. And these fit together where you can make a whole cake out of them. And even this layer cake, you can pull it all apart. So it's really cute. You can change toppings. So there's a heart topping on this one. I'm gonna change that heart topping and put it on my layer cake. And take the strawberry. Oh, the strawberry doesn't quite fit because it's too big, which is fine. Let's put that back then. Not all of them are interchangeable, but we work with what we have. These two, Cakes. I actually changed these back and switched them out. This cake is supposed to have white, uh, a white whipped cream on top because it matches like that. And then they're exactly the same. So I want to show you even like the, the layering comes out of that. So how awesome and well engineered is this? And I'm going to put that back in too. So this is my green cake and my chocolate cake. This also comes apart, and this, this, I don't even know why the inside of this comes apart. It's just like the cake, but look at how much detail they put into that. The layer cake, the biscuit had filling, but I lost the filling. And this cake, raspberry cake comes apart. So those are all of my desserts. And now let's go to my main course. So this is another one of my favorites, and I'll show you. They're a little mixed up right now. But look at this spread of food, this big buffet of food. So it comes with these little chopsticks here and then it's in this cup and these are all erasers so they all erase really well so you have your ramen here and you have plates of food and this is just a plate of all green beans because we just kind of swap them all around you can kind of put your green beans wherever you want so everything comes out if i don't want peas in my ramen and i want hot dogs in my ramen then i will put that i could put that in there everything is interchangeable so it's really cool tempura shrimp and even this tempura shrimp the little tails come out now, and then these three are my absolute favorites. So this is the fried rice, and I wanted to show you how the fried rice comes apart. So the fried rice is so cute. It's like a peas and, what is that, spam fried rice. You can pull out the peas, like the engineer, it's not one pea at a time. They kind of put it all together, and then the spam comes out like that. And then you can put it back in. So you just pop that back in, and then you see now you have your spam. You just gotta line it up correctly. You put it in. And then you pop in your peas and you put it back on the plate like that so, and then this look at how detailed these bamboo steamers are so if you've never had dim sum before these are little chinese appetizers i would call them and they steam them in these bamboo steamers and they actually stack them on top of each other and they just steam it like that the dim sum these are juicy dumplings i don't know if you've ever had those before but they're delicious you bite into them and it's like soup that comes out of them and there's a little uh cabbage underneath them so the detail in these is amazing. I love this. 
So these are my food collection. This is my Chinese food or Asian food collection. Um, there's more Asian food. Let me show you these. So these, actually I got these at, they, this set at Target. The other set, these are from Japan. So they're a little more detailed. These ones from Target are bigger in scale. So we have some sushi. It's really cute still. You can pull out these for the sushi. And then I had the soy sauce. It did have a lid, but I lost the lid. So it's this little red cap. And now my American food collection. So there's hamburger and sandwiches, and here's a hot dog with lettuce in it. So originally this hamburger actually didn't have this lettuce. I took it from the hot dog. So you can actually put other condiments and stuff into your hamburger. Of course, the more you stack, it won't fit in on the bottom. But look, I put a tomato into my hamburger. So you can, lettuce actually fits better because it's nice and flat. Kind of get away with putting that in. But you can have your burger, fries, and a drink, and even the straw comes out of this drink. And the fries come out of this fry case. So this set is really awesome. Now let's look at what else I have. More food, but just simple. These are just fruit and veggies. So we have our carrot, corn. Look at the corn. Do you see? The corn actually has all the little details in it. And then just this uh, mandarin orange there. And let's see, what else do we have? So now we have our utensils, and these are just basic pots and pans for cooking. So we got our pot, and these are all erasers still, and you can cook and pour stuff into the pot, like you're pretending to pour stuff into the pot. And these feel really good, like they're all rubbery and soft and everything. Fork and spoon, your spoon comes off, your fork comes off. So really cool. Put the lid back onto the pot. And my last set are my animals. So I have this pink seal. This kangaroo, penguin, these are penguins, really cute. His feet come out, I mean, everything comes off, but there. I have, the, I don't know, dolphin, whale. You guys tell me, what do you think this is? I guess it's a whale, right? Because dolphins aren't white on the bottom. But dolphins, are, or whales are black, right? I don't know. Cow, so the, all the animals, everything comes out, but they're kind of scary looking when you pull out the, their body parts, I think. Look at the headless cow there. Little, little on the scary side. We have this bunny and this kangaroo. And even with this kangaroo, her little baby kangaroo pops out. But again, like, I think they're kind of scary when you start taking apart the animals. The food was okay, but like, if you look at how they do the eyes and the face, it's a little scary when they don't have faces. They don't look complete. This little frog. You can see this whale, for example, or a dolphin doesn't have any. I lost the inside of it because we were taking it apart and I think we just misplaced it somewhere. But really cool. And then that's my entirety of my... Oh, there's one more. Just um, simple needle thread and tape office supplies that I have. But really, these ones are my favorites. The food items here. They just make yummy little erasers that look so good to eat. So I hope you enjoyed my eraser collection. Be sure to like, subscribe, and comment. And stay tuned for more tutorials. Thanks. Bye now.